Hey everyone, today we will be learning how to create custom typography in GIMP. So I've already created my text that I want to edit, and I want to select this text, so I'll go over to the text layer, right click, and go down to alpha to selection. Now to create a path from this selection, we'll go up to select, to path. Now I want to deselect these marching ants, so I'll just go up to select none. And I'm also going to hide this text layer. Now I want to go over to the Path dialog here. And you can see the path we made from our selection. I'm going to make this visible. And then I'm going to be able to edit this path by going over to the Path tool and selecting it. Now if I hover over this path and click, we now have the points we can edit. You can directly edit points by just clicking and dragging them out. You can also move full letters and selections by holding Option, selecting a point, and dragging. You can also create curves in these lines by holding Command and dragging out from a point. You can also add points by holding Command and clicking in the middle of one of these lines. And then we can click and drag this, just like we did with the original points. See how I've created a custom letter that's different than the original text typography. Now we need to fill this path. You can either click Selection from Path here, over in the Path Tool Options, or you can go over here to your selection, right-click, and go down to Path to Selection. We can now hide the red lines of this path. I will go back over to my Layers dialog and create a new layer. I then will fill the selection with the Bucket tool, making sure that my new layer is active. And then to get rid of these marching ants, I go up to Select, None. Did you try out today's tutorial? If you did, send us a DM with your design on Instagram and have the chance to be featured.